Hello everybody, Sift here again with another Dome Keeper run. And today we're gonna be playing the AI Dome, the new thing they added. Doesn't matter what weapon we're gonna use, doesn't matter what... Actually, the gadget does matter. Uh, but I don't think we're gonna change the gadget, I do enjoy the one we have. And uh, yeah, we're gonna play on hard, medium maps. Actually, let's go large map side and let's go with automation HUD, not long cycles. So what the automation does is everything is gonna be AI control. And what HUD does is that we start with some very, very basic upgrades. So we don't have to care about getting them. Uh, I think it's, uh, it's worthwhile. Oh no, we are evil again. We destroy the local people. So what do we got from the AI? Uh, first of all, this is the dome here. For the three upgrades, I got these four. So this is that we can see our life. This is that we can see when the wave comes. And these two are that we can uh, see our resources. Who cares? So uh, these are our stats. And here are the three AI things we have going on. First of all, we got this on the stun laser with the AI activation already in place. So this thing is going to stun opponents. We're going to upgrade that to have more stunning and also more damage on this because this can also damage later. Then we've got the auto cannon, which is the DPS weapon, also with the AI, act uh, AI activated. So it says that auto cannon activates even when you're not inside the door. The whole idea, by the way, is that we're not even going to be at the dome. It's just going to clear out the enemies on its own. That's the whole idea. And then we've got the spire, which is a defensive spire that shoots down incoming projectiles. So this is an anti projectile projectile building that also either uh, zaps faster or uh, fires in shot burst dealing well with salvos. So you either go for the anti-salvo or you go for the anti one at a time. I guess. Uh, so we're going to decide what exactly I'm going to go for in a moment. But for now that we don't even have money, we're just going to go ahead and explore. And we can even see when the next wave is incoming. So let's just drill down until we find our first. Oh, you can even see when the first wave even activates. That's good to know. Because I did not know that was even uh, and a data. I didn't even realize that was a data. And now the wave starts uh, actually counting down. So first of all, we're going to instantly take drill power. And then with the next ones we're going to find, we're going to go with pickup strength. Because that's my opening move. In my opinion, that is how you should open up the game. Uh, and I always, always, always clear out at the top of all the domes. Uh, I'm going to say let's go over here. And then let's start digging down here. We found our next resources. Very nice. Let's pick these up to go for pickup strength. Can I pick up four? Yeah, four is decent, so we don't have to double backtrack. So we're gonna go up now. We're gonna power up pickup uh, power, and then we're gonna try to hopefully find enough resources to uh, be able to upgrade something defensive. So let's go pickup strength. Let's run down and let's start drilling off to the right, all the way to the right, and then two down. And I think this is going to be the line I'm going to be drilling in. Let's also go towards the right side. I don't think there is any reason not to. Let's actually pick this up. And let's go on exploring. There is a good chance we're not going to find what we need. But guess what? We don't even need to be at the top. Literally. We don't care about what's happening at the top. This is chill vibing over here at the bottom. Didn't find anything off to the very left. We shall go. And I did now find something. And we obviously have enough strength for these. Because that is literally what the upgrade did. Off we shall go. Let the, let the fight happen. We should be clearing the fight out anyway with our little turrets. Oh, we're getting hit. Okay. I mean, it is what it is. I was under the assumption my turrets got this. Yeah, they were doing a good job. They did it. We lost a little bit of life, but still the area got cleared nonetheless. And uh, let's level up. I would say pick up uh, drill power if I can do so. I think I brought enough. Yes, nice. So we're going to go with drill power. That should expedite the speed at which we find new resources. And the moment we find even more now, uh, we're going to obviously go ahead and start upgrading my defensive structures. Mostly the DPS turret first, in my opinion. I think DPS turret goes first and uh, maybe the spire second. Uh, maybe the spire second just so that... Actually, I think the stun laser is good for masses of small opponents. And then the turret is good for DPS. Now, the spire is straight up specifically for only getting uh, anti-air hit so that doesn't really matter that much to me getting the anti-air hits in but nonetheless that's also gonna get upgraded at some point especially because a lot of ranged opponents are gonna start appearing at some point and we need to have the ability of clearing out everything right that is part of how you build up your defenses in this game and we found the iron down here now points are incoming as far as i'm seeing which is very bad, of course. But we can't do anything about that. Let's do the old trick slowly over here. Nice. And now we're going to go up and try to upgrade my turret instead of losing life. You know that is the plan. Or at least that's what I would hope the plan to be. Once are incoming. 
Right side is toasted. Now left side is also going to get toasted. But we're going to upgrade our DPS laser. So auto cannon. We're going to say it gets movement speed. It gets damage. It gets time between shots. So in general a good upgrade for that thing. I can't really do anything here. There is no reason for me to stay up top. Literally. Uh, wait a minute. I can upgrade my defenses. Wait a minute. I made a mistake. We're going to upgrade this one. So whenever I get hit for 80 we heal. No whenever I get hit for 200 we heal 80. And next thing we're going to go is for that one. So yeah, opponents are getting stunned and whatnot. It's also time stop the actual timer because that is what I have that. And let's continue exploring in our normal fashion. Let's have this over here, please. And let's continue on the drill path to the right and the left. Let's hope I'm going to find a magnet. Not a magnet. Um, what is it called? I hope the next thing I'm going to find is going to be a lift. A lift is the best thing that could happen to us. If I'm lucky enough, I think I need one more of these. Here we go. We found a good old relic. And we also found even more iron. So I'm super happy about this. Uh, can I pick all these up? I don't think I can have all that at the same time. Let's just go upwards here. No. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Are you serious? And let's go up with these. And then uh, hopefully we're going to find the lift. If we find the lift, then we are already in a perfect run. If we don't, then I don't know what I would like to get. Some kind of money resource gathering machine or something. Probe and resource converter. We're gonna go with resource converter. In my opinion, that is really good. Gives you free resources after all. Let's see if we can upgrade it instantly. Here it is. So, uh, what is this? Cobalt to one iron. <coughs> Sickles conversion time. What I want is cobalt to cobalt. Although they might have re removed that, right? Not cobalt to cobalt. Uh, money to money. The same thing he already accepts. Can I see this for a moment? Convert 1 to 3 over 0 0.8 circle. This one, this is what I want. Multiply your money is this what this does. So we're going to go with multiply your money. But is there an upgrade for multiply your money? That's my question. What is this? Cycles. Uh, multiply iron. Uh, instead of taking 0 0.8. Oh yeah, instead of it taking half a day and giving us 3, a 2 pretty much. Because you give 1 to get 3, so you get 2. It actually gives you 9. So that is uh, 5 times better. Right? But the conversion times becomes 2.5 times more. Yeah, I think I think we're going to go with this. And it's not 5 times better. It's like 4 times better. Yeah, 4 times better with a conversion time that is... Um, 3.5 three, three times slower. I'm not sure if this is worth it. I'm really not sure if this is worth it. Well, for now, because I'm not going to get that, we're going to go convert 1 to 3. That is very straightforward to me. And we're going to obviously take that. Um, now I would like to upgrade, honestly, drilling related things. But I do not think we have enough time for that. We need to get some defense related things going. So let's pull these all up. That's actually one behind, so I go a bit faster. And then we're going to go down and pick the next up too. Because as we said, the game even... Uh oh The game pauses. It uh, doesn't pause, but we don't need to pause. Like the, the DPS here is all AI controlled. Uh, let's make this into a higher DPS version of itself. I don't have enough money. Uh, what does this get? Shots before recharge. Three. Recharge time becomes bigger. And then... Can all of these go to and to all of these? No. This thing can only go downwards and the other thing can only go upwards. This is recharge time becomes faster. And this is shots before recharge becomes four. And then they both can either become projectile split. So splits the projectile hit the 2 200 damage. Or energy trap... Shooting down a projectile generates an energy trap that will catch more projectiles. How much it can capture depends on the potency of the incoming projectiles. So this is offensive. It's projectile split into multiple small ones dealing damage to enemies. Uh, and this is uh, defensive. So you can catch more projectiles. And then if I go the offensive way, split projectiles are faster and more plentiful. And split projectiles can go off in any angle. And the other one is catalyst trap. Improve the efficiency of the energy trap to catch more projectiles or the energy trap now also stuns monsters. Honestly, I'm going to go with split. We're going to go with DPS. And for these choices, one and a half cooldown. I think this is uh, every two seconds pretty much. This is every six seconds, shoot three uh, projectiles. This is literally every 1.5 seconds. So uh, shoot down a projectile. So this is... One per two seconds, this is one per one and a half seconds. So this is straight up better, especially if we also include this, which makes it 1.32. In the same vein, I could also include this one, which uh, skews the um, unmount even more. 
Uh, I think we're gonna go with a constant raid. I think we're gonna go with this one, but I don't think we have enemy snipers yet, so we don't care about that. Area stun. Honestly, let's hope that this fight is also doable, and uh, let's continue upgrading our uh, drilling gear, and let's continue going downwards. Hopefully, we're not gonna lose life here. We need to find a bit of water, is my main issue. And the next thing I'm gonna upgrade is movement speed, so that we maybe explore fast enough and find things fast enough. Let's level up here. I'm gonna power up the healing thing a bit more, because this isn't level up enough, the cobalt thing. So let's level this up. Okay, we didn't find enough. Well, let's move, level up the movement speed and off we shall go. There is no reason for us to even stay here. They got this. And yeah, they actually did got this. Very nice. So let's continue. My AI dome does its job. I have to say, this is very chilling. You don't need to be there for the fights. You just need to be down here drilling, doing your job. And then the dome is going to do the other half of your job. Which, uh, yeah, I mean, that's uh, that's the main use of AI, or at least it's supposed to be, you know, it's a, it's a tool. It's a tool that you use so that you further your actual own agendas, I guess. <laughs> Random talk about AI, very, um, I guess, relevant to the current state of Earth right now. Hey, look, a little alien. Nice, I would like to get my little pickup alien that we had at our time. Let's leave the water here. I don't really think we want it. I, I mean, we don't need it. Wanting is a completely different aspect. And we also want to dig here, so might as well. Here, very nice. We found even more water. It's actually good for us. Let's pick this up. I think we have enough pickup strength to pick that up without having some real issue. Let's continue digging the way we always dig. Didn't find anything. Let's continue downwards. Maybe hopefully find anything here. And we're gonna see later. I mean, we should find something here for sure. Uh, at least one iron is gonna appear in a moment. Any minute now, any second. Okay, no iron, that was very bad. Let's leave this water here, as that's pretty much the middle path. Okay, that was a very, very bad pull. This is a very bad pull, didn't find anything. And the next fight is incoming. Once again, there is no reason for me to go to the top, as uh, I'm not gonna change anything, <laughs> right? Without iron, I can't upgrade my upgrades anyway, right? So, what I'm trying to say is, I don't have iron. Without iron, there are no upgrades. So, what's the purpose of me going up? Just just looking? I don't think so. Here we go. Now we find iron. Now now we're talking. Let's go. I'm going pretty slowish here, but in a moment we're gonna do the pull. Oh, oh randomly the... <laughs> randomly plants. Let's pick these up. I think those are enough to be able to... Oh, 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 oh here we go. Now we are rich. Now we're talking. And a good thing I... Let's leave all these here because this is the middle. I'm gonna just drill to the very left and then we're gonna start going upwards. Now, I do know that I have the time stop uh, to, to activate so we get more free time. But uh, right now, I mean, we we, de we definitely are digging around here. Maybe, maybe, now that I'm thinking about it, maybe I should not have gone for the time stop as the free upgrade. Maybe for the free upgrade I should have gone for the defensive dome, right? Because that thing works on its own pretty much. And you always have it permanently active without even needing to invest into anything. While the rest, you need to go upwards always and help out. Well, that is that then. What can I say? Too late. Too late. Should have thought about it better. But doesn't matter because at the end of the day, we're going to continue pushing that button whenever I go up. And if I get some kind of teleporter or anything that actually helps me uh, activate that more often, we're going to be a bit better. So the min-max right now is a bit on the lower end. But it's okay. Uh, I don't want to activate this yet. I want to cancel right now. And I want to uh, upgrade that thing to give us double the amount of iron for four. Ah, I didn't bring my mother, water myth. You know what? We can do that next time. Let's upgrade. Let's let's get one, uh, two, three. And let's upgrade pickup strength. I don't have for pickup strength. Mo only movement speed is a choice. But I think we should go for DPS. I think I should go for damage on my machine gun so that we have a better control over that. So uh, this is machine gun. I can either go for the machine gun or the heavy bullets, and that's gonna then split into shotgun, but I think machine gun is better, because a bunch of small opponents are mainly going to be my main issue. Let's run down now. With four, I can't really do anything other than maybe upgrading a couple of things. Uh, let's pick up the money, as I said. Uh, the water. As water is definitely important. And let's also continue going for another pull. You see, that's why I want to have the... Um, what is it called? The What is it called? <laughs> the, the, the lift. We definitely need to get a lift, in my opinion. That is maybe the most carrying thing in this game. That can help you a lot. And now we found four water, so we're definitely gonna upgrade the minigun at this point. Uh, we're gonna wait for this to come in. 
I, I have to say it's not really fun when you're sitting here and just waiting for this to happen. So, uh, yeah, there's that, I guess. Let's go with the minigun. Here we go, 6-2. That should make it powerful enough to pretty much clear everything. Uh, this, and then we can also go here. And now it has more movement speed, and it should definitely carry. We don't need to be here once again. The purpose of upgrading the turret, the tower, is to not be there at all when it clears out and whatever it clears out. Once are still alive in the wave, that's really bad. I think the next thing I should upgrade is... Uh, drill strength, I would say. Drill strength, movement speed. I think movement speed is the place, so we go farther back and faster back and forth. And I really, really hope that we're going to find some kind of good relic. Either the pets or something that helps you out here. Let's pull these in. Let's level up our movement speed, I would say. Actually, if I have a drill strength, I'm going to go... For, uh, I'm 50-50 on this. I'm 50-50 on this. Drill strength becomes double. We're going to go drill strength. Because this also gives us time, right? The more drill strength you have, the more time you get to... Um, the more time you don't lose by drilling. I didn't need to bring that in. Because drilling itself also takes time, right? Throw these over there, so everything is lined up correctly. And let's hope we're gonna find some kind of devious mach machination over here. And that's gonna help us out. Water. Very nice. I'm gonna drill that in the way back. On the way back. Clear out everything. Uh, from the top layer. Oh, here we go. What is this? You see, that's why you clear always the top layer. Or at least that's why I'm playing like this. Nice, we find iron. And I also found my beloved alien who wants water. And we have water over here. I'm so happy that we found this guy. So this guy is a magnet. Uh, more specifically, he is a um, magnet. I guess a magnet is a good explanation. But what he is, is a pickup drone. Uh, off you go into some other pickup range. Uh, honestly, I can just go down here. And we're going to continue the exploration path below. I don't need to go up, up there. My little mini pickup drone is going to just pick up everything we need to bring up to the surface. I think the next thing I should upgrade is the stun laser. Uh, I think stun laser plus... Oh, nice. We found a one. And this hopefully is going to be the lift. As always, lift is a godsend. Hopefully we got the godsend. Uh, otherwise, I guess maybe drill bird would be useful. I need things that literally don't need me to go up. I want to not go up ever. The wave cleared, as you see, without me even being there. Man, this is su such a more chill experience. This is literally what you want from this game. You don't want to go up. You want to just chill in the bottom. It would be nice, really nice, if at the top right... Dev, this is a suggestion here. At the top right corner... Add like a little indicator what's happening at the top. What is this? Prospecting meter. A meter showing the distance to the nearest resources. This is the first time I'm seeing this. You know what? I'm willing to take this. I'm willing to take this to see what it is, you know? Just to see what it is. Just to learn. Uh, I would like to upgrade the water thing. So let's run down pretty quickly and pick up some things. Okay, I see the resource meter now. Which I guess exists. It doesn't seem to be doing anything. I definitely can pull more than these. Without having a sizable downside. Bring this up too. And off we shall go. Um, here we're going to upgrade the resource transformation thing. So instead of getting from 1.3, we're going to get from 1.10. At least that is what I understand is going to happen. And I don't want to go up and down very often. So this really, really fits my whole idea of what I want to be doing. Get the water. Get the water. Get the water. Did I bring only one water? Tell me that I brought only one water. Genius. Anyway, then we're gonna go with... Uh, I guess movement speed, honestly. Because uh, if I upgrade my pickup strength and I later find what I want, which is the lift, then uh, we will lose all that pickup strength. You don't need that much pickup strength when you have the lift. Uh, this guy's gonna bring these things up. Actually, no, I want to bring this water up right now. Uh, go ahead and pick that one iron up. I'm gonna bring up the water. We're gonna double that thing. And then we're gonna activate... What we need to. There we go. I even have the time stop. First of all, I want the repair to happen easier. And then I want the converter to be more powerful. And then I'm going to go ahead and convert. Here we go. 1 to 10. Uh, time stop. And with 6, I don't think I'm going to be able to invest anything with 6. This is powerful enough in my opinion. I think the time has come to go for this one. Fire time, 6 seconds. Cooldown, less. Yeah, this is very, very important. What is this? Increase the stun power of the stun beam. Stun strength. I don't care about the stun strength. I care about this thing. 
Fire time 3D seconds, cooldown 6. Oh, it makes it bigger. Th this actually makes it less. This is good. This is worse. Stun is can shoot for a very long time, but needs a bit longer to cool on. Uh, I'm not sure if this is valuable for my... I mean, it definitely valuable for many. 3D seconds shooting. 26 seconds, 24 seconds uninterrupted shooting pretty much. What are these? Area if stun efficiency. Increase the stun blast to size and strength. Wait, can I make it AoE? Creates a stun blast around the target. Monsters that stun nearby monsters with partial strength. Actually, this is good. Um, yeah, that's actually really good. I'm gonna run down. I don't think I need to upgrade anything yet. Uh, but actually, factually speaking, that thing, the AoE stun, is gonna carry us for small opponents. Because there are small opponents in this game. Here we go, water is there. The, the pickup bot is gonna pick it up. I mean, the pickup alien. I read the devlog and uh, uh, it, it said that the dev wanted to have a bunch of robots, but... His partner, or a, I don't know who, <laughs> said that it would be better for... Wait a minute. When do the resource... When are the resources visible? Do you see that the resource meter is here? It's okay. Um, It's a bit weird. It's a bit weird. I need to pay a bit more attention to it the next time we see something. Let's continue going. Opponents did appear. I don't care. Let's I can make the water up here so that the pickup bot... The pickup AI... The pickup AI goes ahead and picks it up. Let's continue drilling, slowly. And that wave is cleared, and no more uh, plantation appeared. Okay, I was not aware that is a thing. Not the more uh, the, the more waves pass, uh, the more plantation exists inside the dome. Uh, not the dome, but the earth. Which, honestly, that's really cool. Right? That's really cool. Let's leave one back. If anything, let's leave two back. Three back? Yeah, this is my normal speed. I can pick up up to four and four, eight. It is my uh, decent amount of pickup without having an actual issue with it. Pick these all in, and let's upgrade movement speed even more, I would say. Or drill strength, but I think movement speed is where it's at. I don't think we need drill strength yet. Off we go to the bottom once again. Let's run it. I want to upgrade my super dome at some point even more. Uh, for anybody that wants to see what the dome does, we're gonna see it when uh, when the time comes. <laughs> Jokes aside, oh, look at this. The resource says that there are resources close by. Here they are. Haha. <laughs> the system works. Do I have enough for 20? I have 3D. Whoop, even more. This looks like a good old 3D to me. 20 to me. I want to power up drill up strength, obviously. Hey, little alien. You come here to help. Go ahead and help. Off we go. Off we go. We need to go up and down anyway. I need to find the... I need to find the what it is called. The, <laughs> the thing that pulls them all in. The lift, the lift. The lift has to happen. This is definitely not 20, obviously. We don't even need to sit around and wait for that. Off we continue into drilling power. And drilling, mining, whatever. Uh, w when it gets to 16, then I'm gonna rotate back and pick that up. Okay, first of all, I have to say, now we are close to resources, and now we're away from them again. I have to say that the way I'm drilling, this doesn't help. And it only shows iron. Oh, okay, this thing only shows iron. That's that's even worse than what I thought it is. Uh, I, s I heard the sound effect. It was like... Whoosh, which I don't know where that came from. It's, do, you, do you hear like some random sound effects? Here we go. That should be enough iron now, though. Oh, yeah, that's going to be definitely enough iron. And I'm stuck. <laughs> this is so much iron that I can't even move. So let's bring these all in here, and then we're gonna do the little uh, pull Tarek. Let's leave it all here. Let's pick up this water too. Let's pick these up, and these up. I think these are enough for the pull trick. If you want to do the pull trick, you have to be a bit on the lower end. Let's bring these back, and let's bring these front again. Hey look, the triangle is sitting on top of the iron there. Very nice. And now we're gonna go up and deposit these. This is the downward spiral where I want to actually be at. Enough at the top, we shall go. I hope this is the middle. I'm pretty sure this is the middle. The reason why I'm opening this up here is ju just to have a clearer path. And uh, preparing the road for the um, lift if it ever appears. Now we're gonna upgrade drill power in my opinion. I still believe we are really good with defensive things anyway. So I don't need to invest into any defenses yet. At least that's what I think, right? I might be completely off and wrong. Uh, we can leave all these down there. We're gonna continue exploring. Hopefully find an artifact. Hopefully find a super artifact. Oh, a super artifact. Very nice. What is that? What is that? Needs two iron as it has two squares. 
Good thing I left army behind here. Iron 1, Iron 2. What does it do? What just happened? Am I literally able... Oh, I have visual 2. Okay, I got visual 2. This is insane. This is insane. This is actually insane. So my whole digging plan is completely different now. Wow, this is... Whoa, this is busted. Whoa, this is busted. My drill strength obviously is good. I'd like to. Okay, is this where I drill now? Yeah, no, no, no. I think this is where I drill now, right? Yeah, look at this. Is that one in the middle visible or not? I think it's not. Let me drill one up. I think it was visible. I think I'm seeing two up and two down. Therefore, I should leave four spots, right? Is this here visible now or not? That's what I don't understand. It looks like it's not visible. So I either have to leave three behind or I have to leave or behind. It's 50-50 on how many I need to leave behind. Uh, but this is definitely busted. To me, it feels like I need to leave four. I am allowed to leave four between each thing. That's what I understand here with what I'm seeing at least. Pull these all through, please. Let's leave them here. This is busted, man. This is OP. I love it. I love it. I really do. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna attempt to leave four and then we're gonna see. It was a bit unlucky than when I tried to do the test. It wasn't really visible what I was supposed to do. Whoop. Bring these in. Whoop. And now we go for picking up things. Whoa, whoa, too much, too much. Too much. Let's start bringing things up. First upgrade we're gonna do is going for pickup strength. So I can pick all of these up right away. The next upgrade. Then we're gonna also time stop. And then we're also gonna start upgrading some of our defenses. Because I don't even know what's happening at the top. So we might randomly lose if I don't do so. Oh, up here it's it's winter. Okay. Take another 10, which our borderline can't even pick up. This is really strong, by the way. Here we go. Power this up. Let's see what we can upgrade. This is still eating, munching. I want the auto repair, but for us to get the auto repair, I need to buy the healing, and I definitely don't want to do that. So I can repair by hand. Same thing with auto repair anyway. Here we go, invest that. Cobalt is useless in general. We're gonna, at the very end, maybe transform it into something else. But doing this. <laughs> Cobalt to one iron. 0.8 cycles conversion times 0.03. What? Iron to one cobalt. Cobalt to one iron. Every one cobalt gives you 0.08 iron, so that's like a very a lot, a lot, a lot. No, the opposite of what I'm reading. Anyway, it doesn't matter. What does this do? Prospective meter. Range and tiles 5. Scan delay half second. Yeah, that's bad, of course. Display the distance to the nearest water. Uh, display the distance to the nearest cobalt. I need to upgrade it. I see. Display the distance to the nearest gadget or relic switch chamber. This is godlike too, but I don't need it now that I have the visual. Increase how quickly the meter updates. Yeah, that should be a given right away. Uh, by the way, it really, it really feels clunky. It really feels really clunky. Range 2, range and tiles 12, and then the, yeah. It really feels clunky. I think it should uh, right away be instantly. It should be more uh, visually appealing and then give it some other upgrades. Because this thing having a delay is just... It doesn't feel nice. That's what I'm saying. Um, yeah, we're gonna go with pickup strength, as we said, because we have like a million upgrades down there waiting for us. So let's go ahead and pick up those million upgrades. Up 10 levels, no opponents even there. I mean, the time is even stopped. As I said, next thing I should upgrade is maybe the stun. So let's bring all these in. I think that's a bit too much. Here we go. That seems good. Hey, look, we have a bunch of cobalt and whatnot sitting in with us. Just going up. Just going up. Nothing's an issue. Everything's fine. Man, I love the fact that we can literally see everything. What a godlike relic. What a godlike relic. I'm in love. This is the new, my most awesome thing from here on out. We're gonna start upgrading here. Uh, have I overleveled this already? Real strength 3, 4. Yeah, I think I have overleveled this already. I think this costs 20 normally. I don't know. Uh, either pickup strength is now the play or first of all, AoE stun. Let's go with AoE stun. And let's go with uh, one more level in the stun, so it helps out a bit more. And now we're gonna level up my... Honestly, movement speed. Forget pickup strength. Off we go to the bottom again. Vroom, vroom. Look at the speed. Look at the speed. And now we're gonna continue on drilling. Maybe we're gonna find said beloved gadgets. Uh, let's leave these all in there. And uh, let's, let's drill at four distance and see... No, this is this is three distance. Mistakes were made. Let's let's roll out four distance and see what this actually looks like. Is there gonna be a big? Uh, I mean, there is a big black 
box in the middle of that, but I can see in there, right? It's it's visible that there isn't anything there. What is this? Portal gun? A zoom out? I'm in love. This is the end of the game, but we're gonna explore everything. There is a zoom out, man. There is a zoom out. I, I'm loving everything I'm seeing. How awesome is that? Okay, uh, right now it's obviously visible that I'm seeing too deep, right? You see, I can see two down. So obviously, I'm, I'm gonna build these out just because. Uh, but this is obviously a two diff distance. So now we have a guaranteed proof that we're gonna be drilling at two distance from here or not on everything. Oh ho ho, that means two distance from top and two distance from the bottom. Well, let's go onwards on drilling everything out. Let's bring these things in. Over here, no up, and then we're gonna do the the pull trick. So bring these all up to this point, and bring this in, and let's go. Stay as bottom as possible when you do this, and leave these all here. In the shaft, in the shaft of at some point we're gonna get the magnet. I'm pretty sure that's what the shaft is called. Wait, that's the wrong drill strength. Uh, here we go. Four distance, four distance. It's insane. And you can do a four distance drilling straight up. Oh, here we find a little uh, little thing. Hopefully it's gonna be a magnet. Hopefully it's gonna be the the the, the most powerful artifact in the game. What what are these guys doing? Tell me that they're eating resources and I'm gonna become mad. I'm gonna leave it there though. I'm gonna leave them there. I wanna see if they eat them or if it's just a visual thing. If it's a visual thing that's just super creepy, I love it. If they eat them up because you left them on the ground, I hate it. So I really hope it's a visual thing, because if it is a visual thing, I'm going to give even props to the devs that they, you know, play with your mind like that. I really love things like these. And the condenser, that's infinite money. Or drill bird, that's drilling. I have so much drill strength of my own, I don't need drill bank. So let's go with condenser, which is infinite to water. Bring this up. And now we're going to level the condenser up, in my opinion. So we can either go for it gives you water faster, and then it collects the water on its own, which is obviously what I want to get. And then the other version is that it makes your passive better. Can it act fire? Automatic overcharge my time stop. Honestly, I don't care about this. That doesn't matter that much. And here I would say I do want this active. So we don't randomly lose. Uh, let's repair once. And let's continue going downwards. Maybe I should start spending um, cobalt for health. And uh, not health, money. Cobalt for money. Uh, I'm going to even leave everything be. So I want to cr create different lines here. I want to have both lines be in the same line because I do enjoy the um, clean cleanliness of this thing as an idea. We're getting attacked. I think the dome should be able to care, care, cover this, especially now that we have the AOE stun laser. We should definitely be strong enough at clearing everything. I should maybe, um, I should maybe, let's go down for deep. What are these sound effects, man? Sound effects are very weird. We 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 went things like these. I'm gonna drill first. I got this. We lost almost nothing. Off into drilling we shall go. You see how that thing appeared the moment I drilled below it? So this is at this point proof that you guaranteed do not need to uh, uh, to go three three by three. Three distance from top and bottom. It's four. I mean, four unblocked spaces is what I'm trying to say. Continue drilling. Okay, leave these here. Drill down. And now we're going to speed up the drill process by picking all these up. And then I'm going to go and pick up the other iron too. And then we're going to level up the drill strength. So I go through these a lot faster. And uh, theoretically, or at least hopefully, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna have enough time to go down, up, down, up twice, and then pick up enough money to power up even my drill and alongside also my um, dome, I guess. Leave this here. Time stop. Uh, this is definitely not enough for drill, guaranteed. We don't even need to go there to check that. I will also open up the water here at the right side, just so that my little alien is gonna pick it up right away. Here you go. And uh, now I'm gonna drill in this line. Actually, I'm not going to do that right now. We're going to do that later. I just want to have a clear path. That's what I'm trying to do. Hey, look, a bunch of little aliens down there. I really don't think they're going to eat it, right? I mean, I'm rich enough not care if they eat it, actually. 
I'll just, I'll just hope they don't eat it, actually. Which would be really weird, by the way. Okay, there is three water and two cobalt in there. Let's see if when I come down, it's gonna still be the same. I'm gonna go up. I have 15 coins. If I have another 15, I have four. And three, that's seven. And three, that's ten. And then another five. This is 15 in my hand. This is actually 16 in my hand. So let's go. And there are another 10 from this little system. Oh, nope. No, 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 no. Ah, it is what it is. I think we had 16 in hand. I was counting correctly. We're gonna go for drill strength. We're gonna go down and drill a bunch of things. And then I'm gonna run up and try to power up my defenses. Yeah, because at this point, I don't really need upgrading my character anymore. We got the drill strength. We are busted pretty much. And, uh, I mean, I guess only pickup power is left for us to actually level up. You know what? Let's leave these here. And let's continue drilling. This time I do want to clean out my... how it looks. This here, what I'm doing right now, borderline doesn't serve a purpose. What I want it to be clean. We're gonna leave the AI at the top to clear out everything. Imagine if we randomly lose, by the way. That would be fun now, wouldn't it? Okay, we didn't lose. We found another victory condition. Which, once again, I don't care about. Here we go, here we go. Money, money. Pick all these up and go. By the way, don't forget to mention in the comments whatever you hate me doing. <laughs> here we go, we found another one. Come on, give me the lift. Give me the lift. Give me the lift. Theoretically, I no longer have access... Not access, but I no longer have room to uh, get anything other than the lift. Right? Uh, I, I don't have any more... I guess chamber room or whatever it's called. So theoretically the lift should be a forced upgrade here. May maybe if there is another new unique upgrade that is just doesn't need a slot to actually be invested in. Then may maybe the lift is uh, is not gonna appear. But I mean I'm not gonna find drill bird. I'm not gonna find any defensive structure because I already have them all. Like I have the laser and the shot and whatnot. Oh we got the 10 coins very nice. Let's go up. Lift. Yeah but that's obvious. Let's get the lift. Let's take the money, take the money, here you go, and now I don't need to, now I definitely don't need to invest these 16s into that, This, those 16 into that, we can just invest into the lift, so we're gonna say get 5 orbs, then we're gonna say it gives us speed, because why not, we say it goes faster, and it picks up more things for 10, is not worth it, so we're not gonna do that, uh, even more speed for us, honestly, no, we're not gonna go up and down, like, at all, at all, completely at all, so let's just start investing into these guys now. So, I'm gonna say we make this thing last longer. The AoE is already here. What is this? It's... It, yeah, we're gonna make this last longer, have a better cooldown. Stun strength. Honestly, I don't care about this. More AoE, what is this? Area growth per monster. The stun blast grows bigger for every uh, a monster entering it. Against more and more. Oh, this is that it even DPS. It normally doesn't DPS. We definitely want that to DPS. So, this is now the next path that we want to take. Let's run down. The water is the main issue at this point. Water is literally the main issue at this point. So we need to level up the condenser. Uh, now that we have the lift, we definitely want to pull these things in. Into the lift. Uh, and that's why I have set that all up. Let's go up here. Start drilling. Hey, little uh, aliens. Man, I really love this visual thing of you get random aliens that try to eat up your resources. I love it. I love it. I really do. I'm all for these kind of weird thingies. Uh, we're gonna go slowly. Do -do 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 -do. I mean, theoretically, I should also continue picking up, uh, powering up my pickup strength, but eh, whatever. I don't think it actually matters. Let's leave these all here. Let's open up this path. Hey, <laughs> what are these guys are there? Although the lift is there. Uh, we're gonna go with one path down. Here we go. This is my actual line, and this is another wind condition thing. Yeah, but let's go. Throw these in there. Now, if we go to the left. I think I should also power up the anti-air. Oh, the sound effect is becoming a bit crazy. Can you imagine if we randomly lose because I'm not even up there and I don't even know what opponents are doing? I can definitely prevent us from losing by doing a little trick called enable auto repair. I'm gonna start running upwards here, slowly. Uh, it feels like we're losing. <laughs> I don't think we will lose, but it just feels like we're losing. Look at all these things we're transferring just because the lift is a thing. And that's also why I just uh, created the triple way. You always want to have a triple way to be able to do this. Because what the lift is doing, it's magnetizing all the things to the middle. 
So uh, while you see the very right, for example, isn't even connected to the rest, there is a, a rock at the very rear right that doesn't make sense the way it is. Now a lot of these are gonna fall down, but while I'm going closer and closer, I'm keeping my pickup button pressed. So I pick these all up at the same time. Which is a little trick I learned. Um, condenser, can I make this produce more? No. Uh, okay, well, if that can produce more, I'm gonna make definitely sure that this is busted. The machine gun. And now we're gonna level up this thing a bit. Oh, this needs three water per upgrade. Okay, water is very, very low on our end. This needs two water. For more AoE. But I wanted to get damage. Well, damage is over here. I need even more water. Okay, we're most likely gonna level up the condenser. And give it, make it give us more water. This thing here. So iron to water to every two iron I use becomes one water. And water to water to iron one. Uh, I don't think I'm on. Uh, first of all, let's definitely invest into more health and auto repair. So we're gonna go more health and auto repair. Ah, uh, this needs one water. Okay, I'm gonna buy a couple of healing on our own. I don't need that much healing. I don't need pickup strength either. We're good with 23. I need water only. The water is the only thing we need right now. Literally, <laughs> the worst resource is the one resource I'm I'm not having. I don't have enough of. Let's throw that over there. I got the little pickup alien continually finding things that I have left in random places and pick them up. I love that guy, man. Maybe the best a new addition in the game. That you got a mini a mini pickup guy friend that just picks things up. How awesome is that guy, man? How awesome. And this uh, and this double drilling range is also really cool. I love it. Let's go one, two, three, four, one below. Here we go. Also go to the left. Ooh, we found even more resources. Okay, we definitely need to get water now. <laughs> we have so much iron that's useless. We're gonna level up everything that only needs iron and nothing else. Because iron has become a useless resource for us. And uh, we're gonna then, after that, start upgrading our things. Water's here though. And a new thing. Uh, this is a super bomb. I do know that for a fact. Look how much iron we just found. And water, very nice. And cobalt. Let's go to the very right here. Let's leave these all behind. I'm gonna do the pull trick. Where should I drop that bomb though? I think at the very bottom, right? I think at the very bottom. Yeah, let's get that bomb and, and try to set it up in a moment. We're gonna also pull all these in. Let's go here and here. Pull these in. Off to the right you go. Drill that. I'm not gonna drill the bottom iron there because then we're gonna just lock everything into place. Man, the visual is insane. Being able to see visually wherever everything is, is awesome. Okay, now let's, let's go with the pull trick again. Ooh, everything's gonna get stuck. Everything's gonna explode. Here we go, drill that. Another resource, very nice. Let's go up here. Bring that in. Leave these all be. And most of them flung up. It is what it is. Here you go, drill down. Even more resources! Okay, we definitely do not need iron anymore. <laughs> I hope we're gonna find some upgrades that need iron, but I don't think there are. I guess health and then drill strength, drill strength, drill strength, drill strength or something crazy. Which is a bit saddish, but it is what it is. Bring these all over here. Come on, leave these all here. Uh, pick these up. Okay, let's go ahead and pick up the super bomb. This is also picked up. Yep, let's go pick up the super bomb. I know that this is super bomb because we have found it before. And let's go downwards on this one. And then we're going to leave it at the very, very, very bottom. So it pops just the ground. In my opinion. Oh, here we go. Nice. Okay, I think that might be a bit too low. So I'm going to say we're going to leave it at this spot. This spot looks good to me. Here we go. Exactly next to the very, very bottom. Gonna pop in a cross shape, should go up and down and left and right. Perfect, that's what I wanted. We're gonna need a bigger lift. <laughs> that's true. That is true. Also, that's not a thing. So there you go with that aspect. We're gonna need a bigger lift and more of them. Uh, let's go up. Uh, some things fell on the wayside, but who cares? Even more things fell on the wayside, but once again, who cares? I'm opening up the right side just in case I'm able to pick all these up. 
Uh, yeah. As, as long as... It doesn't matter that they fall. It really doesn't. Because we got the little pickup friend anyway. So he, he can fix everything that needs fixing. We're gonna go up. I'm gonna start creating water now. Because that is my main concern. Iron is no longer of concern. Especially because we already got two times times ten. Pick these all up. I, I was a bit too early on the pickup. Whoop, go, 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 go. Here we go. Whoop. And I'll pick these up here too. Whoop. Activate the time stop. And let's see what we can get with iron. First of all, let's take that. And the auto repair. Okay, so now that I got auto repair, we are no longer in any danger whatsoever. Secondly, pick up strength. 40 drill strength. Do I need to throw out 40 for drill strength? I really don't think I need to do that. Like, it really feels like a bad idea. 6 for water betterness. You know what? 6 for water betterness. Yes. Maybe I'm going to start creating some water. The lift. Could use one more of these. But honestly, we have 8 water right now. And I need to be very careful with how I spend it. So I'm going to say we're going to go... Oh, let's upgrade this thing twice. Let's first of all make it attack every 1.5 second. Why does this say 9? Oh, I can bring it lower and lower? Oh, I can upgrade this 9 times? I see. Energy. Oh, we're going to go with projectile split then. So when opponents attack in the air, we attack them back every 1.3 seconds. Nice, 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 nice. So that, that's how we're going to do this. I have 37 iron, which is borderline useless. Let's go with movement speed on the stun laser, I would say. Actually, no, we're going to go with 1 DPS on the stun laser. Very nice. So that's dealt with. Uh, I don't need pickup strength once again. The lift is here. It can do its job. We're going to continue just going in loops around the map. See the water. This is going to get picked up. All of these. I, I don't need to care about all of these. Any of these. Like, we, we don't care about... Things that are related to picking up things. We're gonna only pick up when we need to. I see water there, which is obviously really important for us. And I see another artifact. Very nice. Which uh, obviously... Oh, nope. That's the end. I found the end. Uh, we're not gonna open this up. I'm gonna first complete as many upgrades as I can. So that I'm able to... So that I'm able to maybe win. Oh, the artifact isn't even ready to be picked up. So even better. Pick these up. I'm gonna leave my iron B. We're about to find even more iron, by the way. It doesn't matter that opponents are there. Now we got anti-air uh, set up and working. And now we also got stun laser DPSing opponents down. So theoretically, we shouldn't even lose anything. I mean, yeah, theoretically and practically are not the same thing as always. But, you know, you never know. Let's continue. And this is the path of the choice. Off into the left we shall go. Instantly going towards the wall. I am losing a bit of life. No, I'm not. Life is actually stuck. Opponents are still surviving, but life is stuck. I'm super happy about what we're doing here. Let's leave these all be. Nope, let's leave that be. Uh, let's clear this out, because why not? Uh, this is four deep, right? One, two, three. No, that's three deep, so let's go four deep. Which is here. Very nice. I never have seen the artifact be actually almost in the middle of the stage. Most of the time, it's at the very, very bottom. But it's okay. It doesn't really matter. It's gonna sit here anyway. And chill. Okay, this this whole area to the right is done. We're, we're done with the right side. Might as well min-max this. Just to have a nice little clear map. And here is the actual end. So now we unlock that too. And theoretically, we should pick up the artifact now. Which we're not gonna do, obviously. Because I want to power up my building as much as possible. I'm gonna assist the lifts at picking things up after I am done with digging everything out. Here you go. I go from bottom to top. Not really a big difference. Uh, I think the drill path is here. For the four drills. We're gonna leave them be as is. Actually, let's not leave them be as is. Throw them in here. Throw the water in there too. Especially the water. If anything. As water is the one resource we're really lacking and we really need. I think I should go up now and pick up the um, the 10 coins. Theoretically, the 10 coins should be ready in the condenser. Uh, iron is really useless <laughs> at this point. And obviously, that's because of the condenser, right? Because the condenser gave us, uh, at this point, I would say 3D iron or something. And that is those that iron that they have, right? We have 49. So most of those 49 coins are the condenser right now. About 30 of them are. So, there is that, I guess. I mean, it's nice that you can see the change in balance because of the condenser. And I think we're pretty much done, right? I'm just gonna pick all these up, slowly bring them at the top. A couple of them are gonna drop about now. Yep. And then we're gonna go back into that area. 
but most of these are gonna be here. Look how many I'm pulling up. Hey, little alien. He took something that is with us. No, he didn't. It's still raining things. It's okay, though. It's okay, though. We're gonna go down and pick him up. Hey, little lift. I'm faster than you. And now we're gonna go with pickup strat. Just keep the space pressed. Leave a couple behind. So what you're doing is you pick up the top ones and you throw down the below you. Now I can see how this works. Oh, I love it. I'm gonna come back here in a moment. This little lift just let them in there at his hand. What is the left? Wow. What is coming? What's, in? What's happening? <laughs> uh, forget that. Let's go with... Damage on the stun laser. 3 DPS. Stun area 75. Only the DPS increases. I'm gonna say yes to this. This is fully maxed out. Now we're gonna go with... What is the additional split projectiles doubled? Split projectiles are faster and more plentiful. Double them and also the speed. And this is 360 split. What is the purpose of this? Well, we're gonna go with faster anti-air and faster projectiles, yes. Uh, I think stun laser has the most need for stun strength. Does that help in anything? Becomes bigger per enemy inside the size. I guess speed of it moving around. And... Uh I guess we're gonna take it so we cover more of the sky. I have 62, man. What do I do with 62? This is useless. This is useless. And this is already done. Da, 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 da. They're all shooting towards the right. The left side has an issue, though. Whoop, they go over there. Stun laser is incoming. Okay, do you got this? I don't think they got this, man. I wanna see. I just wanna see. I mean, there is nothing at the bottom to go ahead and do so. Oh, we're losing a lot of life. Healing just activated, that's why it's white. And we won. And now healing regions us a bit more. Okay, uh, obviously what we want to get... Uh, theoretically I could do these, by the way. <laughs> Make an opponent take more damage and whatnot. Uh, but I want stun strength. I want stun strength. Stun strength. And then... Uh, Either movement speed or area growth per monster inside of it. Most likely area growth per monster inside of it. I'm assuming that that thing is going to cover the whole screen. See the water, we're going to leave them be for now. I'm just going to go ahead and pick random things that are on the left and the right at, up. I'll leave these here. Might as well leave them to the lifts. Although that's not actually true because the lifts are a lot slower than me. So I want to pick these up. Yeah, I'm a lot faster than the lifts. I'll just pick these all up. And I think this is going to be the end. This is the end. You got my number. Honestly, though, what I actually want to do is... Uh, get this thing going. Oh, no! This was ready the whole time. Well, let's go with convert 2 to 1. No, no. I'm so stupid. It's okay. We lost like 2 coins pretty much. 2 water. Maybe 3 water. Based on how I'm playing. My assumption is that we would have gotten a little more. Okay, there is a little trick that you can do to check if you got everything, and that is go to the very top and just chill with your alien friend. If you go to the very top and just chill with your alien friend, you don't need anything at all. So let's go up. I'm not going to activate this, by the way. We're going to still first get the two waters, and then we're going to activate this. Dun, 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 dun. The music is so relaxing. Let's leave these here. On the right side. Just in case. Okay, so my little alien friend, as you see, isn't even moving. So uh, that, that, that is pretty much proof that we are done with this zone. I have 25 cobalt, man. Uh, there isn't anything to upgrade. Oh, we can upgrade this and this. Uh, there is nothing that needs mm, only iron. This is useless. These all need iron and water. And also useless. Laser is left, and then this thing shooting faster is left. Which I think this thing shooting faster is pretty important. Because at the very end, do you even know how many opponents arrive? So many opponents arrive. Let's go with 0 0.8. I think 0 0.8 is good. And then we're gonna go with expanding laser. And uh, this, I would say. Stun strength 3. Stun strength 5.5 is really good too. Stun strength 3 should be enough. I'm gonna time stop. Time stop gives us 0 0.25 day. I'm not sure if I should wait more days just to condense more water. That is a pretty much an argument that I'm not aware of is a good idea or not. 0.45 circles. That is decent. 
0.45 circle is a decent amount, especially if I time stop now. This gives us 0.25 circles. So if I have 0.2 circles, I mean, how many pips is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, I would assume. So 2 seventh of the day. I don't know how much that is. I guess 2 seventh of the day and then the time stop is another 0.25. Theoretically, the condenser should be ready literally before this uh, wave. I mean, theoretically, theoretically, I'm able to get three more water. One now and two in the next wave, and then I end the game. So with three more water, I'm going to have four water, and four water is how much I need, right? Because uh, I want to power up the stun laser maxed out. So this needs to water, and this needs to water. Uh, I, I'm not going to care about the, it moving a bit faster because, I mean, this is very good, but it's going to cost me two days to get that going. One more day actually to get that going. And uh, I don't really think I need it. But if I get that, I will have everything upgraded. Literally, right? I'm gonna see. Come on. Come on up here, please. Come on, man. Come on. Okay, you're telling me that when I stop the time, this thing also stops in time? Because if that's the case, then obviously that's not what I assumed was the case. We're gonna get hit from those meta rays. Nope, we're not. Zzz. Oh, we are. Yes. Zzz. We are still shocking them, but not a single shot has hit. Oh, now it did, though. Here we go. Water just got created from the right side, actually. From the auto creator. Nice. So I will actually be able to get what I want. So this is fully maxed out. This is also fully maxed out. I could get even lower on this, but honestly, I don't think that is the play. And we're gonna go with stun stuns more powerfully. And then one more stun stuns more powerfully. And then if I am lucky enough, I might even get that one. That guy's a range opponent. <laughs> I mean, the, the, the definitive thing is that range shots are the ones that are getting us. That is that is definitive. 100% definitive. Can you de-level something? Is my question. Because if you can, I would like to level this. Oh no, this just makes production. Yeah, I should have gone with faster production than that. No! No! Oh, okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> I thought I by mistake activated this one. Uh, convert 2 to 1. And uh, yeah, we're just waiting for this water to appear. And then we're done. Literally. Although I could go for max out on leveling the stun laser and everything else too. But eh, whatever. I don't think the speed of it moving around is really that important. And uh, the other upgrade is completely trash anyway. Like uh, th this, this upgrade here is not needed. This one is not needed. That it has a 3 second duration and a 6 second cooldown. That's not needed. This is definitely needed. Strong Strength 5. And this once again, yes, it makes it double the speed at going around. But it also isn't forced. So at 0 0.5, so when, when the day comes to the half, then this should be done. Might as well go down and clear out my dome here just for the lulz. For the memes. I don't think there was anything left. I don't think we left anything behind. So yeah, a lot of water. You need a lot of water in this game. Which is a bit weird-ish. That uh, there is one resource that choke holds literally everything. Uh, but it's okay. Theoretically, we should even beat the final wave, right? Because I have 25 cobalt. And with 25 cobalt, I, I don't see how you can possibly lose. By the way, I just realized something. Is there any chance that you can re-upgrade these? Like, you can put another two in, and then you get even more visual? Because if that's the case, then that is by far the best thing. And the same goes with the alien on the right side, right? Is there any chance you can put input? No, no, the alien isn't here anymore. And there isn't even a circle anywhere. So that looks like a square-ish, though. I don't know. Doesn't matter. The 0 0.5 of the day has passed. So theoretically, the water is raiding for us. Here it is. And let's now go ahead and get the final upgrade on the stun laser. So we power up our right to have 5.5 stun. And now we're going to see, is the AI able to win on its own? That is my question. Let's also heal up. To the max amount and now we're chilling how much heal does the heal heal us 50 percent uh yeah okay 50 percent that didn't look like 50 percent anyway we're chilling we're vibing ranged opponents have appeared the stun laser just decided to stun whatever it wants we were trying to do our best it's not like we have any control on the matter hey look a mid-flight uh a mid-flight <laughs> gorilla just got stunned mid-flight we are losing a lot of life don't get me wrong the boss is not stunnable. Uh, Reaper just triggered. Does Reaper trigger multiple times, by the way? Like, does it trigger every 200 health? Or what? I don't think it does. 
I want this, the boss to shoot as many projectiles as possible because projectiles actually increase our DPS. One of the big opponents is Toast. We're starting to lose life faster and faster. Another big opponent is Toast. Uh, the boss is still shooting. We got this. We should be surviving. You know what? I'm going to repair by hand. I'm not trusting the auto repair. Because there is a chance that the game is like, oh, because it's the end of the game, you're going to auto repair only when uh, in normal game. At the end of the day, a game that just the game just ends. And we won. We won with the AI. With the AI alone. What is the zoom? What is happening? Excuse me, game? Hello? Okay, I don't know what that zoom was at the end, but I love it. I love it. What a, what an awesome mode. I have to say, this is the most enjoyable mode to me right now. Because these turret thingies definitely prove to you that um, they work, right? So just because of the fact that they work, that is enough. Uh, you ask for it. I mean, I don't know if it's possible in the you ask for it mode or in Brutal. Uh, Brutal should be obviously easily done, right? Because we had like 25 Cobalt in this one, so Brutal... I guess with 10 cobalt we should be safe enough. So automation is awesome. HQD, very good quality of life. I love the fact that the dev actually include that. Should have gone with a huge map, by the way. Didn't realize that there was huge for some reason. Or was there not huge until I played this? I don't know. Anyway, automation, insane, love it. Makes the game just straight up more enjoyable. Because this whole part of you are there and just fight the opponents. Yeah, that is good. It is, obviously. Um, that is half the game, right? But you can remove half the game and only keep the game that is a bit more intriguing, that's digging down and whatnot. I think at least, right? Because the upgrade is what you care about. Upgrading things is what you care about. I would like to hear your opinions down below on this mode and in-game on this. Uh, I, I, I don't think I'm going to play more Domekeeper unless you guys really, really love this. So uh, I'm expecting comments on the matter if you want to see more or not otherwise we're gonna find a new game i think right now bone keeper is very much on the rise so maybe i'm gonna go play that uh no not bone keeper uh what is it called bone razor minion or something like that say bone keeper ah, doesn't matter anyway that is going to be it i really enjoy this the the patch was insane props to the devs quality of life is there awesome awesome relics at the ground the thing that makes you see two uh two uh depth you know, to one more depth than you normally see. That That's by far the best thing I've found. And also the little alien that goes around is awesome. Anyway, that's going to be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, thanks for watching. And see you guys around.